Right. Um, now on this question, it's uh, November 2018. It's saying calculate how many. Actually, it's saying given the digits 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, and 9, which gives me about um, 7 unique digits here. There are 7. So calculate how many unique dig 5 digit codes can be formed using the digits above if the digits may be repeated so which means it's a five digit code one two three four five then we allocate a number for every position so which means repetition is allowed therefore which means here we have seven 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 possibilities after which I can now even multiply them together, which is the same as um, 7 times 7 for 5 times, which is 7 to the power 5, which in this case, uh, it's equal to from the calculator. It's um, So it's 7 to the power of 5. So that's 7 to the power of um, 5. Uh, which is equal to 16,807. 16,807 um, unique um, uh, digits. Then 11.1.2, um, the digits may not be repeated. If the repetition is no longer allowed, which means it will be one, two, three, four, five digits. Therefore, on position number one, we have seven options, then six, then five, then four, then three. After which we now multiply. So, which means it will be seven at um, six, seven times six times 5 times 4 times 3 which in this case will be equal to using the calculator 7 times 6 times 5 times 4 times 3 which is equal to 2,000 2,520 different um, uh, codes then from there 11.2 using the same digits now look at it what a question how many three digit codes can be formed using the above digits if digits may be repeated so we are saying the digits may be repeated so you can repeat the digits as much as you want then the code must be greater than four hundred but less than six hundred the code is divisible by five so it's um how many unique three digit code so it's a three digit code in this case which means we have one two three possibilities so the first important thing is saying the code is divisible by five for a number to be divisible by five it means it must end with a zero or a five. Then you would know that that number is surely divisible by five. But if you look at this one, we don't even have a zero. It's not an option. So which means we can, it can only end with a five. Therefore here we can only put a five and it's a one of it. So which means on the last part, it can only be divisible by five so which means on the third part it's one or only one option that is there then we are also told that the digits may be repeated no problem with that the the code is greater than 400 but less than 600 so which means for it to be greater than 400 it means it can and it must start with a with a, a four it can also start with a five it can start with a four a five a six seven eight and nine but we want it to be less than 600 which means it can only start with a five or 
it can only start with um with um with a four or a five which means here we only have two options but on the middle we are told that the repetition is allowed so we can use any of the seven so which means here we can put our seven after which we can multiply them together then from there two times seven times one which will be equals to 14 different digits i'm sure that it was clear god bless you